On behalf of the Pine Bluff Festival Association Board of Directors, which I have some here tonight, Barbara Aiken, Dr. Tom Agerton retired, our board president, Pete Algram, our park coordinator, Will Smith, we want to welcome you to the 13th annual Enchanted Land of Lights and Legends. I'll be honest with you, about five or six days ago, you've been reading the paper, we've had such terrible weather and floods, we didn't know this night was going to happen. So we are very excited. Let's hear a big hooray. We want to thank you for being here. It's a very special, anytime you have a grand opening, especially to be the size we are, you know we are the largest drive-through display of holiday lights in Arkansas. We took over that title about five years ago, and we have grown again this year. So we get a big hooray. All right, what we're going to do, we have Channel 7 here, Dead Permy came down, so we're going to have a segment at 6.08 where he actually is going to be live. Dr. Tom Agerton was one of our board members from the very beginning, was a volunteer out here all those years. He is going to be the official turner on of the lights. This is the official switch. It actually does work. It is a real live switch. So what we're going to do is about the time that Ned goes live, we're going to count down from 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Y'all are going to help me. Dr. Agerton is going to turn the lights on. White Hill High School Band is going to kick in. They're going to do their stuff and follow through. And if y'all just follow through there and enjoy it. Because remember, you are seeing the lights first for this year, right? <laughs> Thank you. Y'all can count back from five, right? Yeah. Okay. Park. We're ready to turn the lights on for this annual event. It's been going on 13 years. And look who's here, my friends, the Whitehall Marching Band. They did such a great job at our tailgate party. They're back for an encore tonight. But we are here to light this park up, Regional Park. The enchanted land of lights and legends is going on from now through the holidays. And you guys are going to be the only group that gets to walk through tonight a mile point two. Are y'all ready for that walk? Oh, yeah. All we need, is some, all we need yeah. is some lights. And to do that, we have got the switch here. And we've got Dr. Tom Angerton. Good to see you. He is board member emeritus of the Pine Bluff Festival Association. And you have been with this since the start. Can you believe how much it's grown? It's grown beyond my imagination. It really has. Every year, more and more lights uh, coming through. You have over 200 lighting displays, and all we need to do now, Tom, is light it. Greg Gustick, the community's ready. Let's start a countdown and flip that switch. You ready? Five, four, three, two, one. There we go. Regional Park is lit and ready to go. This is a drive-through with your family. You can take your automobile and drive through Regional Park every night through the holidays from 6 until 9 p.m. Absolutely beautiful, and it's absolutely free. But they are taking donations at the end if you'd like to drop something in the bucket. It just goes to the situation. 